Question one, what experiences and education make you suitable for this position and why are you running? Mr. Catlin, you have 90 seconds to respond. Uh, experience, I've uh, done electrical contracting, worked with the homeowners, business, and commercial people dealing with the PUD and the other utilities in the valley. Um, so I know their side of it. I know a little bit of our side of it. And, uh, and being a business owner, I can keep under uh, um, payroll and uh, a budget. So I think I think I would be a good fit and that's good experience to be a PUD commissioner. Okay, thank you. So question one, what experiences and education make you suitable for this position and why are you running? You, Mr. <clears throat> Henderson, you have 90 seconds to respond. Okay, well, I started on some of that. I have an extensive managerial background um, with the Washington State Department of Transportation. Additionally, I spent the last 16 years uh, with the Department of Health in, on uh, various boards and commissions. Uh, the last eight were spent with the Dental Quality Assurance Commission as a gov governor appointed uh, public member representative. So I have the background in the government and I also have the uh, commission experience. Good, thank you. Question one, what experiences in education make you suitable for this position and why are you running? Mr. Mitchell, you have um, 90 seconds to respond. Okay, well, first of all, I'm running because uh, a friend asked me to consider it and I actually interviewed for this position 25 years ago. So I've, I've had an interest in the PUD and a commissioner job for many years. Um, my experiences include uh, running a, a large flight school at one point and right before 9-11, uh, it's the largest flight school in the Northwest, uh, operated as a contractor for Central Washington University's aviation department. Um, I am a chief pilot for Lakeside Industries right now, flying a corporate airplane, corporate jet for them, um, and we have worked for them for 23 years. Um, and I've also uh, been involved with several uh, organizations, the Ellensburg Rodeo Association, Chamber of Commerce, uh, Airport Advisory Board, uh, Washington Aviation. I'm the past president of the Washington Aviation Association and actually was one of the co-founders of the Northwest Aviation Trade Show, uh, which is now drawn to about 30,000 people a year at the, uh, conducted at the Puyallup Fairgrounds. Um, so I think I'm, I'm uniquely uh, with my varied experiences and education that are uniquely qualified for this job. Thank you. Question number one, what experiences in education make you suitable for this position and why are you running? Mr. Kelleher, you have 90 seconds to respond. That's a great question. The why I'm running is to bring lower electrical rates to Kittitas County. My experience, I'll go back to my participation in the FERC process of the relicensing of the Wanap and Priest Rapid Stand. One of the things that I did was I attended Kittitas PUD meetings, encouraging them to compete for the Priest Rapids license. They chose not to. But I would also follow, and I also follow today, in fact, I'll be monitoring tomorrow, grant PUDs ongoing meetings. They're a much larger PUD. They deal with uh, the same issues that Kittitas PUD is, but they usually have staff that can provide a slide deck, a presentation, a talk to explain the situation in detail. So I think my ongoing education as to what's happening in the day-to-day -day operation of a typical PUD is up to speed and is broad. Thank you. Thank you. Question number one. What experiences and education make you suitable for this position and why are you running? Mr. Morris, you have 90 seconds to respond. So 
I'll start with my education. After I graduated from Ellensburg High School, I went to J.M. Perry Institute down in Yakima, and I got a auto body repair degree. Shortly after that, as I started in that trade, as I said in my opening statement, my wife and I moved to Seattle. I worked in a body shop there, and then I went to work for the Boeing Company. During that time, I went back to school at Everett Valley Community College and took the, the courses and got my A degree in public speaking. At Boeing, I ran quality improvement for the interior division as well as statistical analysis for them. That started me in the direction of knowing that I was interested in statistical analysis and being in the managerial position. When we moved home, my wife and I both took jobs here and several years later, I bought the shop that we own now, and we have spent 23 years running that shop. In most every job I've had, I ended up in the managerial positions, and I find myself that I enjoy putting teams together so that people, people can do so much more as a team, and I enjoy that challenge of putting teams together to see what we can accomplish as a team. I'm looking forward to the commissioner job because I love new challenges and I think I can bring all of my vast experience from my career to this position. Thank you.